Hey everybody, it's Tiffany here. Thanks for stopping by. So I've just been to Hobby Lobby and I bought a lot of fun things. I hadn't really looked through the paper crafting section for a while and I found so many fun things so I thought I would share with you all. So to start out with, I found these notebooks that are so cute and these big huge pom-pom paper clips so these notebooks i feel like hobby lobby's prices are even like better than ever compared to some other craft stores <laughs> but 3.99 for a three pack of notebooks that are i'm going to do a traveler's notebook with these but they're already cute they're already decorated show you the picture that's on the front but they've got this like linen texture to them that's really neat so i'm excited about those and those match really cute with it so we'll probably use some of those on that and then these gnome paper well this gnome paper collection is super cute too and it's kind of got a lot of the bright those same bright colors so i might use some of them together but let's see, I'll just show you the papers really quick. Those cute little gnomes. Aren't those darling? So there's two of each paper in here. It's only $7. And all of the Paper Studio stuff is on sale right now, 40% off. So it was only like, I want to say $4.20. Something like that. Maybe, you know, under $5. So of those and just some pink checkered some more cute gnomes really cute I like how they're holding the big flowers and then isn't that fun all those bright springy summery <laughs> the bumblebees on it love that and then just some more basic um, leaves and flowers. It's got a couple of sticker packs. Cute little gnome in the wheelbarrow and the flower pot, watering can, whatever. <laughs> and then this is what I was kind of excited about because there's a ton of. Let's see, I'm going to flip this over, I think. So well so everything's not so chaotic there we go there is a lot of a lot of die cuts in here i think this might be cute to do a traveler's notebook or a planner or a even a folio or something like that isn't that cute all the flowers A little gnome face and there's different hats to go with them that's cute anyway I don't know if I need to go through all of them but nobody like you that's cute magical day more hats more flowers more gnomes really darling Especially for people that love gnomes. I have a neighbor that loves gnomes. She made me the cutest little gnome for Christmas. That's cute. Sitting on the mushroom. Oh, look at the little mushroom house. That's adorable. Okay. A few more. More flowers. And hats. And then I love, love these frames too. Isn't that sweet? Okay, fun. Let's see if I can gather that up and set it aside. I've got one more package. It's the, let's see, does it have a title? Bees Paper Crafting Kit. So what I really, oh, I'll just show you this real quick. Look how beautiful that is. 
It's a little personal planner. It's pretty small. It's probably like six inches tall. And I don't think I'll use it for a planner. There's nothing in it, but I might just punch some papers and put it in it for like, just maybe to keep track of my, like my craft um, ideas or plans or something like that. So I just love those flowers on there for $3.75. Okay, so this is what I was really dying over. These papers are very pretty. Be floral. And it's $20.99, but it was 40% off, so made it around $12. Okay, those are pretty. There's three of each. Try to flip through this really quickly, but this, oh, I love this. Look at how beautiful. I like how you can kind of, like it looks like it's just painted on there. You can kind of see through those lemons. I think that's super fun. Some little foiling on those and look how cute those beehives are. And that's the same, so I did, there are some of the same papers in here as in here. So I probably won't show you all those papers, but you can see right here which ones they are. But cute daisies. And look at that foiling. That's really pretty. Okay. That. That. More Cute bumblebees and the flowers and more cute lemons. Really cute. I wish that one had some little flowers on it like the other one. But look at the, how pretty those are, the foiled beehives. My sister loves bees and beehives. So I might have to make her something with this. Those bees have the foiling on them. Honeycomb with foil, very pretty. Some cute plaid, more foil. Okay, almost done, and some daisies. With a couple little, oh, I didn't notice that earlier. A couple little bees with foil on them. That's fun. And then there's the sticker sheet there. Can't really see those. Save the bees. And then here are the die cuts. I just, I like the die cuts because I feel like you can do so much with them as far as like if you wanted to make a mini album or decorate your page. But kind of a fun selection here, bees and flowers. Don't worry, be happy. So, yeah, cute beehive. Uh, some frames. There's only f three frames in here. That surprises me because I feel like there were five in that last, in the gnome one. Uh -huh. Okay, now I'll just quickly show you what else I bought. I love this kind of thing. Um, kind of a chiffon ribbon with the torn edges. And these colors are so pretty. Um, so these were also on sale 40% off. Let's see, it says... So it's three yards. I'm, I'm guessing a yard and a half each there. But love those colors. Um, I got a couple of packs of pretty little flowers. I just love these. Look how dainty and delicate those are. I'm excited to use those on like, like laying across the top of a notepad or something. And look at these pretty little roses. I couldn't resist those. So this one was a lot more expensive. A lot more detail in that, I guess. And some cute pins. Um, for $4.99, those were also on sale 40% off. I think I'll use that pink one in my, my latest project. This is what I've been working on. You can catch the video on my channel. I'll link it below. It's a planner. 
made out of a composition notebook. So be sure and watch that video. But that pen is perfect color. And I also found these stickers to go in it. I might, I might use them to do my weekly plan. So there's two sheets of each. So there's all kinds of days of the week stickers. So we'll see how far they go. We'll probably have to do different ones on, you know, every month or every couple months or something like that. But it's got all the um, number for the dates and even some months. I might try to use those on, well, yeah, since I'm writing the months by hand, I don't know if those would fit on tabs or not. Probably not. So that's fun. That was on sale too. I think that was about $6-ish. Got, I grabbed a bone folder because $1.29, I mean, it's always good to have an extra one. They call it a paper creaser. Not a bone folder. Same thing. Grabbed a pen. They're on sale also from the Paper Studio. Fine pen and just some cute sticky notes. I'm always looking for sticky notes and it's fun to have cute ones. Can't see them very well, but these little daisies are sweet. I think those would actually look how cute that is. Those would be really cute in my planner. Hmm. Fun. And a couple other things. I grabbed some more. I love these giant paper clips. I put pom poms on them or bows or whatever to put in my planners and traveler's notebooks. Let's see, they're a little smaller than these ones. But same idea. And so those were on sale also. So a little tip they have these and um, the Paper Studio brand in the scrapbook section for $2.99. And so on sale, that makes them about, gosh, I feel like it was around $1.79 when they're on sale. And then they also have them with a different label. Let's see, I've got one right here. And these are, these, are $1.99, but they're in the more in the front section by the stationery where I found um, they have the little notebooks and they're like sticky notes and things like that. And they're a little like these ones are brighter gold, um, but I think I like this less bright color actually. And these ones look like they're the ones that are kind of covered in plastic, so I think they'll hold up really well I can't tell anyway so I love those I also do like um, I like to do macrame on the paper clips also uh, I grabbed one of these bad boys it's only six dollars and 49 cents for four paper storage boxes and they hold a lot of paper here I'll show you one yeah I've got three of them already put to use here but I don't know if we can <laughs> show you like that one's about half full and it's got that much paper in it so. yeah I love those I did put a little tape packing tape across the bottom just to make it extra sturdy, but I also got these for $2.99. I mean, what great prices. Those paper storage boxes, I used to buy them on Amazon that were pretty similar, and they were like $10 each, I want to say. But $2.99, and then I think I can slide those into, let's see. I'm hoping I can slide it into the paper storage box. So that I'll have more like of a divider. Oh, perfect. Oh, wait, almost. Let's see. Is that the top? No, for some reason. 
We'll kind of, oh, I see I've got something in the way here. Hmm. I think that will work, yeah. I think that will go in there. Then I can have it a little bit more organized. So. Okay. <laughs> Super fun. I've got, I've been buying a little more paper use, uh, lately than I usually do because I have <laughs> a couple rooms full of paper in my basement. Are you guys like that? But I wanted some new paper. Okay. And then last thing, they have their happy planner things on sale, 40% off also. I thought maybe I would use a few of these in here. It does have kind of some of the same colors. It's really pretty. So yeah, I love those colors. And they're kind of the matte. And they're clear, so I think that will look pretty. Find the beauty in simplicity. Those are really pretty. So, that is about it for today. And I'll be sharing some more of my planner with you soon. Thanks for watching. Be sure and subscribe and give me a thumbs up if you want to see more paper crafting videos. Bye-bye.